to dip the round gold Straight from the heart, so emotional I let my life fall fall while I'm writing these poems I mix it up with the beat, I grind the mic and it's How's it going, y'all? SirTech20 back here again with another episode of Dark Souls for Prepare to Die Edition. Um, as I mentioned before in the, uh, the very first video I did, um, the DS fix from Durante that I had installed, it was making things kind of slow-mo. Um, what I found out was a lot of that's to do with FRAP, since most people that use FRAPs know that when you use it, it sucks your frame rate down the drain quite fast. Um, getting, uh, 23, 25 frames... It's not bad, it's kind of tough to deal with, but whatever, what am I going to do? I don't have no $200,000 supercomputer. <laughs> Damn it, really? Oh, I start recording a video, I get the hiccups, what are the odds? Okay. Um, let's see here. I'm going to get rid of this guy up here because I want to fight the Black Knight. <coughs> Damn it. I hope I don't have that throughout this whole video, that's going to be irritating to me. I imagine it will be to you guys too. Come on, what you got? No. Come on. Not that one. I always have a hard time parrying that one. Come on. That's not what I want to do. Oh! First time I've ever actually parried and reposted that. I have to find myself. <laughs> actually, we gotta get taken to pig. The pig. I don't have any bow, do I? Nope. So I guess we do this like we usually do this, and we do this. Come on. And you know it's just not as slow when I actually do this. Ugh! Holy shit. Hello there, good sir. Uh. <laughs> you don't like that? Wait, is that big? I was gonna say, that big bitch is coming in. It sounded like the dragon just got back. Do it again, bitch. What the fuck? Yeah. You don't like it, do you? Okay, come here, Mr. Piggy. I really... Uh, okay, good, I made it. <coughs> now, I'm not sure if you can do it all the time, but whoa. You done there, big guy? Now, when you get up on top of your steps, you're able to stab him in the ass. Let's see if I can do it. Whoa, holy shit! Oh, spazzed out a bit there. Oh, uh, maybe... No, 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 You need not have a fit, sir. God damn it, really? Holy shit. Um, no! He can plumb me easy with as low in level as I am right now. Can I stab him right in the ass? Oh shit. 27, really? Yeah, right up your ass. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, well, hi. hi. <laughs> um, bestest. <laughs> Holy shit, bro! Take a chill the fuck out, pill. <laughs> up. Oh. No. Ah, damn it! My bad. My bad. Oh wait. Oh shit. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being a little too gutsy right now. Gotcha. <clears throat> See, I did it like a boss. Never move once. Right. Okay. Oh. Excuse me. Okay. I'm likely going to be so screwed with this one, too. <clears throat> I've never actually been able to parry a black, you know, well the black knights I can if, like as you've seen in the first one, this, the one with the regular sword, but this is the one that's got the sword that can reach from, um, you know, from Michigan to China. <laughs> well, maybe not that big, but how do you do their good kinds of, oh shit, oh shit. Are you gonna follow me, huh, Mr. Pock Pock? Uh, you just, you're afraid, oh shit. Oh, oh, oh. Still coming down? I don't know. <laughs> he could. <clears throat> Wait, did you just go? Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no. Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna probably die on this. 
<clears throat> so just be expecting to laugh at me and hurt my... Ah, as you can see, this sword, since it... Or sword. Since the shield only has... Can I get behind you and backstab you? Uh-huh. Oh, not scared at all. It'd be a lot better if I... I wish I was good at parrying that big bastard. Why don't... Hey, why don't you do... I can do this. Yes, backstab. <sighs> well, granted, if I do die, I'm like right next to the bonfire, so maybe I should turn. No. <laughs> oh boy. <clears throat> I let him do that. My bad. I didn't die, trust no. I couldn't even move from that one. All this fucking shield sucks. Did I get you finally? Yep. God damn! <laughs> and I got the Black Knight Greatsword. Jesus Christ, you do not want to know what I had to go through to get that. <clears throat> okay, repair my shield. I definitely have to get myself a higher stability shield. Now I'm going to upgrade my vitality. If you want to endurance, I'm going to try keeping it, my vitality low. Not uber low, but... Um. Okay, so both of them... Yeah, I'll do strength, okay. <clears throat> Actually, I don't, I can, what, the scales, ah, seeing strength and dexterity. But dexterity gives better bonuses overall in the long run. Come on, what you got? Ah, really? Oh, my bad. I am. Oh, I could tell that Black Knight pissed me off. It just. Oh, I lose all concentration when I'm pissed. Come on, get your head in your game here. This is a minor enemy. He shouldn't be giving you any shit at all. Come on, hit me. What you got? Try it, bitch. 204 now instead of 200. <clears throat> okay. The whole low vitality thing is not really my usual play style, but you know, and just beating it four or five different times, having vitality like 35, <sighs> having vitality like you know 30 to 40, it just you know having it lower, you can't make as many mistakes. So, I mean, <clears throat> and this, uh, I haven't played this game in a while, maybe th three and a half, four weeks total, so. But when I do play, I really don't have any trouble taking out any boss in the, or any enemy slash boss in the game, but... Come on. I usually miss the parry just because I'm impatient. It's not even me sucking, it's just me, you know, knowing when I'm supposed to parry. But I parry like a tenth of a second too soon, and in this game, you dead. Oh, you bastards. I, whoa, oh no you don't. I heard that. I'm gonna come on, come on, come on. Uh -huh. Hello to you too. Really? Nope. Oh, you fucker. I hate this part. And me getting 14 frames a second right now does not really help me much. I'm probably gonna die doing this. 
Ho oh, oh, ho, invincibility frames with a backstab, I... Nope! Come on. Sorry, bro, I don't, I don't have your back. <coughs> wow. Throw it right now. <coughs> Sorry for the coughs. <coughs> Oh, I'll be pissed off if I lose my voice for this. I got a bit loud when it came to the Black Knight, you know, cussing and stuff like that, so. Usual stuff. But hey, you know, it's only bad if you give up. You know. Just giving up means the game beat you. That's right, bitch. <clears throat> but, you know, live through a thousand, two thousand, five thousand, ten thousand death, you know. It's just how we do. I actually did not think I was going to be able to hit you doing that. Holy shit! Did I get it? Whoa! <laughs> My ninja reflexes. Right. Come on. Wow, this frame rate is so wonderful, isn't it? Okay, hit me. Come at me. <clears throat> In your face, bitch! Yeah, do you notice how when I hit back, or er, Perry and Rapalce to do to backstab him? It's not, um, like a fiber, you know, 10, 20 second animation. Of course, like I said, a lot of it could have been fraps in my last video, but... <clears throat> really? You guys... 65 damage and you die? I thought they took a little bit more than that. mystery key here to free the bitch <clears throat> oh and I don't know if I'll have decided or not by the time you guys see this video but I'm wondering if I should uh since that mystery key <clears throat> then unlocks the door to um law trick of law trick of Kareem I think and that was my bad wrong timing but I'm wondering if I should uh did he drop something? No. Wondering if I should let him kill Anastasia. I think it's Anastasia of Astora. I could have probably just murdered her name. I believe it's Anastasia though. Wondering if I should let him kill her and then fight him in Anne Orlando to get her, you know, Firekeeper so like that way she can talk. Or just kill him early to get the ring of, you know, the ring of favor and protection, which I really don't use that much. A lot of tiny things I'm still debating on. I thought about doing a, you know, rush through playthrough of this, you know, go to the bosses as soon as possible, kill them, and yeah, okay, playthrough's over, but, nah. Why did I not two-hand backstab you? Get up. You dead. Or no, you're not. <clears throat> no. Really, that's all you do? For real, bro? Hmm, you... Probably gonna fail on this too. Would you frickin' Got impatient. Okay, can I please use the night shield? Don't tell me it's heavier. God dang it! <laughs> Wait a minute, I have a bit higher, uh, can I roll? Not fast enough. What about this one? Really? <clears throat> then I'm probably gonna murder your name, and if I do, dude, sorry. But Cambietto, I think it was. He commented on my first video and mentioned the, about the dark wood grain, dark wood grain ring nerf, where you have to be below 25% equipment burden for it to work, which is like makes the ring kind of pointless to me. But come on. Stab me already. Thank you. <clears throat> I don't like to, even though I could use a heater shield and I'd, ha you know, I'd roll decently. I just, I don't know, I just feel like that's really slow. And now I'm going to have to S this up because that's a little bit of health I was missing was bothering me. Um, huh? Whoa. 
Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm dumb sometimes. You do not do that, good sir. My bad, early parry. Or see, cause he usually the only thing this guy right here usually ever does with me is that god dang. Uh, really, I got hit by that. <clears throat> that yeah, that right there's all he usually ever does with me. How the fuck? Nope. What you gonna do, bro? It'll just take me a little bit to get back into the whole groove of things and the timing on the enemy's attacks, you know, the parries and shit. I'm no god at Dark Souls as far as that goes, but once I get back into the groove of things, I'll be much better than what I'm doing right now. I promise you that. And hello to you, sir. to do you gonna drop baller swag sword the ZMB says <laughs> oh hello I actually forgot about you being right here <clears throat> appreciate you get out of my face okay base my key I'm not opening up that door right now two Estus flasks really oh hello not the better neat Holy shit. You're the pokey dudes, aren't you? Yes, you guys are. I messed the parry on. Messed the parry low. I missed the parry on those guys a lot. Can I drop anything good? Of course not. Why would you want to do that for me? Is that like the only freaking thing you guys know how to do that's the biggest reason why I never attempt to parry those guys it just that's the only thing they want to do with me is like that big oh, bleh. <laughs> look at that stupid shield slam thing I don't even know if I want to touch you bro come on big guy no oh yeah that stupid man oh please do not buff him Oh, massive damage. This might be a bit of a fight. Oh, you didn't do it that time? Okay, sure. <clears throat> Why do I have a feeling I'm attracting everybody else? I was wondering when you're gonna do that one. Oh shit. Close. God, I never. I'm gonna have to <clears throat> watch for when he does that, like that double slamage. Do you, do you lift up your feet or something, dude? Mom. <gasps> so glad I'm using the heater shield right now. That would have probably killed me. Holy shit. Get a little temperamental there, bro. Come on. God, <clears throat> why do I always miss? Now you're gonna do the double, right? No, what the fuck, dude? Nice. Large Titanite shard, right? Just a, whoa, wow, fine, don't be nice to me. Now I'm gonna open up a shortcut between, um, Filing Shrine and the Undead Church area, so I'll see if I can do so without actually screwing it up. Haha. -ha. 
Now, I could be mistaken, but if I remember correctly from all the other videos of this game I've seen online, if you free the Knight of Lautrec, the Knight of Lautrec, the Knight Lautrec, up in the, up in the, up in the, up the stairs and where the dude that casts that shit is, why don't I just show you? That bastard. If you go up the stairs to the, uh, left of him, all the way through then up those stairs, you see him and you're able to free him. From what I've seen, if you don't take that Firekeeper soul, he doesn't kill her. Or she doesn't die. Or I could be thinking of something completely different. Which wouldn't surprise me. Are they still following me? Oh. So glad I was doing the parry thing. Okay. Man, I feel so horrible that I'm not up to date like I usually am on, you know, the Dark Souls lore. It's nice to be able to just talk about all the, you know, the tiny tidbits that make this game so awesome. Okay, compare my stuff. Get leveled up. Already requires 1,200 souls. Uh -huh, sure. That once. <clears throat> you see me bounce between the decks and the strength because with the claymore, from what I've noticed, when you get it up a bit higher, like the strength or decks, one of them will give you a three point damage boost, like from like 128 to 131, and the other one only goes from 128 to 130. It's like, oh, okay. Not gonna ask why, but sure. And let's meet Mr. Andre and Ms. Dora. Can I do it? How do you do good, sir? Smithing. Can you reinforce my claymore? Yeah. Oh yeah. <clears throat> um, yeah, I don't have enough money to buy the crest of Artorius. The, the door leads to the grave of Sir Artorius the Abyss Walker. Go get yourself. New content's gonna be fun. Actually, do you know what? I'm... No, I'm gonna do one thing. We go all the way back to Firelink Shrine because... Because... I get ten... Or, ten... Estus Flasks. My god, I'm getting kind of aggravated with myself. I, I know all, all these terms are ready. It's just like going to say them and it's like... Bleh, bleh, bleh. My tongue like tries crawling down my throat like... No, I no say you... to eventually get to the bell gargoyles but I think that I'm going to uh wait can I do that yeah I believe that we're going to take out the moonlight butterfly first the easiest boss in the game well excluding asylum demon and Taurus demon now I'm not even going to use the shield to protect wait should I see I'm I'm thinking of all this stuff on the go out I don't have any specific thing planned out for these episodes like Okay, in this episode, I gotta do this, and I must do this. It's like, nah. Whatever happens in each episode happens. Hello. Hello there. I believe we are not... I, I can't help it. I don't like your dial... You're an asshole. I don't like you. Hello. I realize that I have... But I... Yeah. No. Oh, my God. It means so much to me. Oh, my. Oh. I know. I have to... So what would that... Yes, it would. Very well. Now, only the strength of your miracles will be determined. Will be determined. God damn it! Really, part of the strength of your miracles is determined by your faith. Right. Oh, my favorite one. Like what? I didn't do it, and I can't buy anything from you either, can I? No. Come again. And 
I'm not making excuses or anything, but I don't know if anyone can tell that I'm a bit tired doing this. I'm not tired of this game, but tired right now while doing this video, but I just gotta put out some more Dark Souls stuff. Because Dark Souls is the she is. Okay. Wow, and I almost forgot that I activated the shortcut. It was about ready to go all the way back around, and you guys would have been like, come on, man. You already went this way. <clears throat> the one thing about the Moonlight Butterfly fight that always got me killed, always, it wasn't even the uh, that big ball of magic stuff that, it, you know, that the Moonlight Butterfly would throw or spit out at you or cast at you. It was that beam of light. I'd always time the dodge wrong. I'm going to definitely have to be dot. Wait, really? I, I just realized that. Wow, I'm an idiot. I didn't even realize I was fast rolling again. That endurance upgrade helped out. That was close. But yeah, I say we get rid of Moonlight Butterfly. I'm doing my best to make the challenge where I don't upgrade everything. Ah, oh, you asshole. That was a horrible attempt at a parry. No, you don't. You are condemned for life. You shall perish by the strength of my blade. Okay. <coughs> hmm. Well, we're at it real fast. Might as well talk to Sigmire. Or Siggy. My God. <laughs> You're standing, dude. You're not sleeping. Oh, forgive me. I was absorbed in thought. I am Ziegmeier of Katarina. Quite honestly, I've run flat up against a wall. Or a gate, I should say. The thing just won't budge. No matter how long I wait. And oh, have I waited. So, here I sit, in quite a pickle, weighing my options, so to speak. <laughs> <coughs> I believe it's Sigmire of Katarina, a.k.a. The Onion Bro. Still closed. Still. Mm. Very good. Now I believe his little quest continues in Anne Orlando, and then you see him in Blight Town, and then one more time... In Lost Isolith, I believe. <clears throat> and before anyone asks, well, <laughs> I'm not touching this big guy right now. Whoa, that was close. Well, the fact that I'm able to roll real fast is going to help out with the Moonlight Butterfly fight, obviously. So. Oh, my goodness. Excuse me. Ah, oh, bad of me to be yawning during the video. Bad luck. <laughs> I wonder if I should even attempt the Black Knight. Not yet. I don't think so. Not even going to attempt it. fall I've died one too many times in that little area so really don't feel like falling again whoa okay. <clears throat> oh, that was such a fail get your ass up feel the wrath of my claymore Hello, Wolfring. And hello, soul. Okay, um... You know, while I'm at it, well, once I get to go to this bonfire, 
<clears throat> and before I go down to, because I believe I'm going to go down to where the, the Black Knight with the Halberd is, to be able to um, get the Crush Shield, I believe, which has good magic defense. 1600, okay, so we got quite a ways to go yet. Go down this way. Mm -hmm. I even want to attempt this. Well, at least if I die, I ain't got very far to go to get my souls back. Oh my god, really? One hit does that much damage? You guys are beasts! Holy shit, you guys can hit that, that ain't even right. I'm gonna do this. <clears throat> and I know my commentary is probably being a little bit different in my first video, but. Sorry. It's. Uh, I don't know, just for some reason it just. Uh, with this video. Or, while playing it this time, it's like my mind's gonna blink to all the lore. Oh. That was a lot less, uh, slow motion. You have got a lot of help, bro. Remember the very first time I played this, I completely ignored this tree. Didn't even see it there. Then when I seen it in a video, I was like, what? Really? I figured it was just, you know, since it was like a forest area, it was just a big ass tree. That, you know, that I wasn't supposed to go there, and then it's like, oh, well, what a surprise. Dark Souls manages to surprise you at almost every turn. Give me Green Blossom. Asshole. Me need Green Blossom. I mean, see, it kills me though, because when I looked at them, I never even bothered to look up to see them actually moving. I just thought they were stationary trees. Like, well, don't, my dumb man's got a big surprise. Okay. Come on. What was that? Oh, okay, I did not even know that. Well, I've never actually used that move with a claymore. Now, I'm going to kind of skip a bit here just to get my ring. Holy matrimony. See you later there, big guy. That just shows I'm probably going to have to fight you a little bit, ain't I? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I can do this. Come on. Oh, I almost did not hit that jump right. Why the hell are you right there? Nope. You come to me. <coughs> I am not going over there to even falling off in the wall. I about did it anyway. Now that I got the wolf ring. Yeah. Now at least when I attack someone, I'm not so easily just shrugged off. I really don't like how you're standing close to the frickin' ledge. Oh, uh. I'm not really afraid afraid of heights, but when I know that there's no bottom to what I may jump down into, that's what gets me. Like if you know, like if it's on top of a barn or something, like yeah, okay, whatever, I got this. But a place where I can't see the bottom, it uh, no. Like with the abyss, where you fight the four kings. When I first did that, oh, I was whining like a little bitch. <laughs> Wee. Okay. 
And it's also a good thing that we're able to fast roll in this area. I can't fast roll, right? Yeah. Because that crystal lizard that I hope I don't screw up with when I go to get him. Don't you even think about your little bitch. No. No. Thank you. The large titanite shard. I don't want the chunks right now. But take what I can get. Especially with this game. And don't forget the armor set. I believe it's short. Is this longbow or shortbow? I know it's one of them. Longbow, yeah. Wait a minute. Is that thing actually better than what I have? 24, 12, 12. Not really. It's also not much worse either. Doesn't that just look gorgeous? Okay, I'm not intending to look at my package, but... <laughs> Don't ask. I think this is the way to go, right? <clears throat> I'm hoping I don't die with him. Although it's entirely possible. Yeah, right there's where the shield is. But there's also a rather large annoyance. But it's the Black Knight that has my favorite Black Knight weapon. Well, even though I know I said the Black Knight sword was my favorite, but the all-time favorite Black Knight weapon of mine is the Black Knight Halberd. I absolutely love that thing. The damage isn't insane or astonishing or anything, but what? And I want to parry, but I don't want to fuck up that parry. Ow, that hurt. How's this feel? Ooh, 149. That's what, that's what I'm talking about. Can I try parrying you? Maybe? Uh... I've seen a lot of people do it, but I don't want to mess the parry up. Even though that's how you learn, I know that, but... I really do not know why I dodged with that. Oh yeah. Yeah, no chain backstabs, cheap ass. Did no. I'm so glad this shield has got a hundred percent. Want to go do this straight? Nope. Uh, I'm not good at doing that. Come on, what you got? Oh. You see why it's never wise to attempt it when you're not confident about it? <sighs> Get out of here, cursor. I am so horrible at this. I'm gonna attempt this. Okay, yeah, that back step should give me room for the drink. Right? Oh yeah. No, we don't. I just wanna get like one parry on you just to feel cool about myself. Well, I can just hear the people in this video. Man, you could have parried him so many times already. I'm just... Uh, don't have his timing down, I guess. I don't want logical thing, though. You know. I'm not bad, I'm not good, I just don't have his timing down. Then again, I've never really made it an effort to ever, ever attempt to parry these guys before, so it's kind of like a new experience thing for me. I really actually didn't want to do that. I didn't get my favorite weapon. Oh well, you see me be so wonderful at parrying. 
I'll get better though. But in my defense, even though it's not really a defense, I've never really. The only is there the only one I've really ever been good at or decent at parrying is the one with the Black Knight Great Axe. That's only because the damn thing's so huge. You know, I mean, it just it's like real big compared to the skinny little thing of the halberd. And am I gonna save at this bonfire? No, I'm not. And the biggest reason why, you know, why I haven't really gone to the gargoyles and I could have already ended them is due to the fact that I'm, uh, trying to take out, like, all the optional bosses before I go to the ones that progress the story of the game. So there's, there's Capra Demon, there's, um, yeah, there's Capra Demon, there's Moonlight Butterfly, the, uh, Gaping Dragon. I want to say ceaseless discharge, but you have to kill Quilag first. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Not even gonna rest at a bonfire again, we're just gonna go right to the Moonlight Butterfly fight. And once again, I apologize, I imagine, I, I don't even know how many times I've said this already, but if my, uh, the whole commentary or the, just, my ability to bring, you know, to talk about the lore while I'm doing certain things and how the lore writ how the lore of the game itself relates to where I'm at in the game. If it ain't really on par in this episode, that I'm sorry. It, I'm to blame for that. I probably should have... Whoa! Probably should have rested up a bit before doing another video. As in between these, I've also been playing Dishonored, which I recently beat. My ending was rather interesting. Okay, come here. I don't like how you guys like that. It's not very nice. I can't see shit, actually. Okay, now I can see, kind of. Nope! Oh my god, these guys hit so hard. What the hell's my health at? 329? Wow. Come on. My goodness, I tell you, this is what I mean, though. I'm used to, uh, excuse me, when it comes to this game, I'm so used to just having, you know, my endurance, my vitality upgraded to batshit crazy heights, like, between, well, not in the very beginning, but, like, maybe my stats would normally be, like, 16 to 18 vitality right now, and a lot more in endurance and a lot less in strength, but it just... You know, I'd all, I was always able to fall back on it, and now that I'm going to low vitality route, I just feel like I'm having to rely more on skill, you know, to survive. As, as far as trying to spam the keys, it, it don't work that well in this game. Maybe. Oh, shit, but I didn't kill him, though. I actually forgot to... You're going to drop an egg, firm, er, egg vermifuge? No, fine, screw you, then. Uh, nope. I can't summon air yeah, because I'm dead, so I can. Oh, I'm hollow, so I can't summon the witch Beatrice. So we just have to solo her. And. Oh, that was a. You dumbass. Wow. I. Huh. Oh my gosh, see what I mean by I'm not up, you know, up here, you know, with what I'm doing? <laughs> What's it, shields? 95. The crest the cre or the crest shield that I want with magic protection is at the un or the undead asylum where you go back to fight the straight even. Wow. Apologies. But at the same time, I'm having a blast with playing this thing, getting my ass whipped. So hopefully you guys are too.
Jesus Christ, that thing takes a lot of help. That's gonna be a pain in my ass. Why don't you do the other one? I don't mind because I can dodge it easy. Is this the one? Really? Is that all you're gonna do? Is this the one? Oh my god! Yeah, she spams that all the time. For real? And this one's easy. Whoop! Oop. 